Nico Robin right here. Remember that nigga. And he's lobby, water yeah. seven, nigga. Her go crazy, nigga. Black oh, man. Emperor Black Day. He is back. Oh, oh my god. Wow. So he stowed away on their ship. Buggy. Buggy yeah. Tag. He's got a, a, quite a reputation though. He got a reputation, but I mean, I'm not. And I know Dragon may be a savage, but considering the people that the, the pieces that Blackbeard has, is gonna be, they're gonna have a tough time against the Blackbeard Pirates, especially because they don't see it coming. They have their guard down pretty much at this point. What's good, yo? We back, RTTV. Gang, 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 gang. And if it's your first time here, it definitely won't be your last. Make sure you kill, murder, and smash that subscribe and that like button, man. Let's get this video to 6K likes, baby. Yes. Yes. Let's do it. You want to see One Piece movies? Well, you know what to do, man. Smash that like button, bro. Yes, sir. Ski. Comment down below your favorite One Piece movie, by the way. You know I love Zoro from the movies. This is not canon. Like that nigga said, yo, no bullshit, yo. That World Z movie. <laughs> that nigga said that was the best Laurel no, fight. Joel said it's not canon. <laughs> that shit no, might no, as well uh, be canon. Now, now the one that we watched, they said they talking about Film Z might be a little canon, though. Sure. It does make sense because yeah. it puts an emphasis on every every character. He trained pretty much everybody in the Navy. Yeah. So some, some uh, that's a very canon. weird non-canon movie. It's like Niggas. they found a very thing in the middle that could thread the line, you know what I'm saying? That nigga, that's, bro, they tip. So you see yeah. how thin this shit is right here? You see that? That's yeah. how thin they tiptoed that shit, bro. Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. Can you do that? What? If you're like, your life was aligned, or you wanted to get a million dollars from right here to the end of this room right here, you think you can like tightrope some shit? I think so. How about run across that bitch? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Nigga, this weekend nigga I was the baddest nigga in the world. Zip line it. Tell me why I said get to the zip line, my nigga. The niggas had a bridge, my nigga. Four of them bitches. Every one of them was some balance and act bullshit, my nigga. Oh, like that. Nigga, no, it's like a skinny plank of wood. Yeah. You gotta walk across the motherfucker. Just holding on to like this fucking barbed wire shit. <laughs> this shit is shaking, nigga. You look down, it's like, I'm gonna die. My nigga, I was like, this is the dumbest shit. I like shit like that. I've done like those obstacle course things. They have one like in, in back home. Right was a wood like. Was oh, a wood you're talking about in um, I think it's a wood Connecticut. Was a wood thing. Yeah. Oh, damn. No, no, I'm shit. not talking about brown stuff. <laughs> it was oh, really thin. Yeah, it's another place. Okay. So like, oh, if you take yeah, the raw check, like like you could place. step through that shit. That's what I was. That's what I was saying. Not nah, was it sturdy? Was the wood thin? The worst part about it was not about how how the wood was, right? It was that like you hey, get to yo. the middle of it and you gotta take the hey yo, you gotta take your harness off the fucking shit that is saving you from fall to then clip it onto the other side because there's like some random shit. Oh yeah, I see that. Yeah. I'm like nigga, this can't be safe. Nigga, Joel's done I'm that before. I'm clipping myself in the middle of this shit, 300 feet in the air, nigga. If I happen to trip right now, it's over for me. I'm like, nah, this is- I respect you, man. Yeah, you do that shit like it's water. Yeah. <laughs> Come Tell on, me. man. All right, so we have, are on a new adventure here, guys. <gasps> Sanji new season. New arc. Sanji season. We, I'm not even going to say what it is. The name of it? You're not going to say it? Okay. We're in Zoe, baby! Yeah! yeah! Does it say it on the screen, man? It does say it on the screen, bro. Are you supposed to read the screen? Yeah, come on, Jay. But like the arc, if I read the arc, the name of the arc is not going to spoil nothing. Okay, whatever. Well, <laughs> if you want to watch ahead on our One Piece reactions, man, check out our Patreon. We got one to two weeks ahead. That's six to 12 episodes ahead, depending on how far you want to get ahead. You can catch the full uncut reactions there as well. Patreon.com slash RTTV underscore. Let's get into this next two episodes, man. Episodes 751 and 752. One Piece. Mm. You see how they reanimated it, though? They had to. Look at the GOAT! Top 5 Shanks, nigga! The hell? Nigga killed him with one with one arm, bro. 
うせろ I think you show Conqueror's Hockey episode one, nigga. <laughs> like, what? Dude, he, we didn't even know what the fuck that was, nigga. We just thought he intimidated him. <laughs> Chank is a real one, bro. He gave up his whole arm, bro. You know what I was just thinking about, though? Imagine knowing Shanks and how strong he is, and then you come to find out he lost an arm from saving a kid. You would have to think, like, all right, that kid gotta be significant. Like, something at least. All this happened before he met Ace, right? He had the devil fruit when he met Ace, right? Yeah. This is after he met Ace. Nah, it's before. Oh. This? Before. Yeah. He had just ate the devil fruit right here. When we got the Ace flashback with the kid, he already had the gold yeah, yeah, fruit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like how they, they did it with this quality, though. Mm. Yeah, right, bro. Like, me, like, I kind of want to see it in this quality. Always saving that nigga, bro. That nigga would have been dead. <laughs> now you would have. That's fine. No more Zoro, nigga. But you niggas don't want to permit. But I guess who saved him after when that happened? You don't want to give him credit for. Yeah. He should have. Yeah. Because so much happened. <laughs> he just saved Luffy right there, nigga. He didn't even catch that right there. Nigga. The nigga was about to hit this nigga Luffy right there, and this nigga cut him. Oh, okay, this is going through the just uh, how he met all them. Still one of the best arcs in One Piece right here, yo. I need to see the movie. There's a movie? Need... Oh, you're yeah. talking about like it's all comprised? Yeah. Okay. And we animated differently and shit. Mm. <laughs> Oops, up? Gangway? I'm not gonna hold you. I actually enjoyed the villain in this arc as well, too, yo. Huh? Luffy just be ready for the smoke. Uh, that that move is cool. Man. What, the, the disappearing act? That's just cool. I fucked that shit up. Oh. But it shows a thriller before you go. Gotta go! That nigga Vega. K Kudo? What is his name? Yeah, it's not it's Kudo. Yeah, him. Like, I, that's, yo, his shit was lit, bro. He had that quick step, too. <laughs> Nigga Bato knows all about the straw hats, bro. <laughs> he's really like us. Like, he's supposed to be like... The people watching One Piece. Yeah, I guess you like been watching their whole journey throughout this whole time. That is fine when you put it that way, yo. <laughs> the finesse or the fly, the introduction to the finesse. What? Yeah, boy, he made you a plate, bruh. Chef Fry Rice. Nah, this arc was kind of fire, too. Yeah, I like the Don Krieg. That's when we got Miho versus Zoro. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Like, you're right, you're right. Yeah. Oh, he's Wow. Nigga, he's a trash. Zoro's a bitch. I like how they changed the whole shit. Yeah. Right oh, oh. Yes. Yes. Oh, yes. Wow. yes. This is my 
fucking type of shot. What the fuck? You say, yo, you're not gonna stab me my back. Even Sanji's backstory is lit too. Yeah. Who was the enemy that he was fighting? What was the name of Don that? Don Creek. Don Creek. You said Don Creek. Yeah. This nigga had a fire ass backstory yeah, too, yo. When this nigga Luffy was climbing up that mountain, his hands is bleeding, nigga. Woo! No chopper, no chopper with the blue nose. Who do you think out of everybody has the weakest backstory? Of and it doesn't mean it's bad, it's just the weakest. It didn't hit as hard as our auto. Yeah, it's definitely Usopp. Usopp or Brooks? The only thing that makes Brooks. Actually, no. Brooke. Because, yeah. like, you didn't really. We didn't really get too much context on what it was. Yeah. Like, we just knew that his, he lost his crew, which is a sad ass yeah, thing. Yeah, but like, he was forced to be on a ship yeah. for fucking 50 Actually, years wait. after yeah. he was dead. I'm tripping. The that's fact that he sad, lost man. his I'm crew, like, oh, nah, yeah. it's back to Usopp. The fact that he even lost his crew and he had to eat the dead, dead fruit, nah, that shit was actually kind of crazy. And he couldn't so get I'll back to Laboon, back. like. Yeah, Laboon. Yeah. Now you can't forget Laboon, nigga. And for how long he was on that boat for, he was just on that boat for, for decades, centuries. Mm. She was the most surprising one to join yeah, the group. Yeah, she was mad. It was mad Frankie. and predictable. You know what's weird? Like, at first, she kind of forced herself on the ship. You no, know? 100%. Nah, she <laughs> forced herself on the ship. That was one of the coolest uh, Usopp looks, though. So, Soviet King was a lit, was a lit vibe. Yo, bring back Soge King. We missed the Soge yeah, King. This is all Nico Robin right here. Remember that nigga. Any's lobby, water yeah. seven, nigga. Her shit go crazy, nigga. She has the best backstory. Yeah, it? technically she has the best overall backstory art, nigga. Gear, yo, we got gear two and gear three in her backstory, nigga. <laughs> oh, so well power so alone. Ocho willpower alum. I'm not gonna lie, that was so quick. Look at his face. Look at, yeah, his face. Look at his face. He's really ultra <laughs> instinct right now. Yeah. That's a hundred mil on your so head. He top. say he shifts a bone from another part of the body to the other. He said. Oh wow. And it makes it gigantic. Oh wow. Third gear. Third gear. Yeah, we got. And we got fresh into Frankie's backstory and Frankie. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Robin's backstory was so big, we was able to recruit another person while we was getting her backstory. Like, yeah. Robin was fucking annoying for a while, though, nigga. With her. I'm not going. I'm not going. Nah, I really, that's, that's one of those shits I had to keep coming at you about, nigga. I'm like, you gotta respect, like, the way she came from and what she went through. Bitch, get your ass over here, yo. Ow! <laughs> How easy was that? Yo, that was the most left field shit for me. Remember, I was like, I didn't even believe that they actually recruited him. Yo, Joel said they was getting this nigga for a drip. I was like, this nigga, and who I, I thought it was gonna be him and Paulie. <laughs> <laughs> like, Paulie, now nah, Paulie's gonna join the crew. <laughs> I actually fuck with One Piece for how they recruited Brooke, though. That's just actually mad funny, nigga. Y'all kind of your crew? Alright. The hell just happened? <laughs> Luffy didn't feel shit, nigga. What the hell just happened? Wait, they said that they wiped out all the white beer parties? Am I tripping? Mm -hmm. What? So the white Edward. beer's actual son? Who is this? Who is Edward. This? That's dangerous. Oh, that's the shit we seen, the emblem, right? That's the person that's on um, Doflamingo. 
Nah, that's nah. not it. Nah, nah. They didn't have a mustache. These niggas are pirates that get seasick. That's crazy. <laughs> yeah, I'm about to say hey, the same hey, one of God, yo. Yeah. That's God Usopp. <laughs> 200 M's on him. What the fuck? <laughs> What the fuck? Zo, so, it's an elephant island? It's translated as elephant. Yeah, it's a city on an elephant. That's lit. That's the, yo, One Piece never stops with some creative shit. Oh, it does make sense that they're on that island, which is why it's a water volcano. Oh, wow. Yeah. And the, the ground was Remember moving ground, too. Yeah. yeah. Oh, shit. That makes a lot of sense. Wow. Wow. That elephant been living. That's wild as fuck. That makes sense. He got to have back problems. Because he got the whole city on his back. <laughs> That's a bar, yo. Wait, when they said that shit about Edward, they said that this nigga been wiping out the island, um, the places that was associated with White Bear too. Mm -hmm. That's what he was doing, yeah. Man, that nigga does not fuck with his pops, nigga. What the fuck? It's like he's trying to take away everything that his, his pops ever did. Yeah. yeah! They're here. It's fucking they're here. Lit. They're here. You know who's there? You know who's there? The Jerry? finesse of the fly dresser kick fi kicks flying and Luke Kang! That's Young 177 right there. <laughs> What's that guy's? That guy's like his name. <laughs> What am I looking at? It was his face. But all his face, I couldn't tell. It was his ass, I couldn't tell. <laughs> that was one step, bro. You feel me? Yeah, you seen that's that? That's wild. <laughs> How many steps does it take per day? <laughs> yo, this sounds like car. He was trying to chill on the, on the sunny, bro. Why would you even want to chill on the sunny? The sunny's over here. Yeah! Dragon. <laughs> Nigga didn't even ask about Luffy or nothing. How's <laughs> Robin? Wow. I had more than enough with that. He been helping, bro. He probably been reading the news, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. That's a cool flag, What's yo. What's about to happen? Blackbeard! Oh, Emperor Blackbeard! He's back! That nigga Sabo beat the <laughs> shit out of him, bro. Yo. yo. It's bison. bison. Yeah, that's my guy. Where the fuck is he at? All white place. All white place. Only all, all white places I know is from thing. He said he's hiding Chaco. under. He's hiding under a ship. 
What? So they are both to go wear the Revolutionary Army. Oh, oh my God. Wow. wow. So he stowed away on their ship when they left Dressarosa. Y'all really pulling up on Dragon? I don't know if that's a good idea, bro. This show is so fire, bro. This show is so fire. <laughs> Burgers is crazy. That nigga Edward right there, nigga. He kind of looks like white man. <laughs> so he's not really his son then. Yeah, no, I don't believe yeah, that. That's not his son. She's just capping. She's just capping. Billy Jean. Oh, yeah, Billy Jean. It's not my love. <laughs> this kid's an idiot. She said, There's no way you're not. She doesn't even know. Evan, but the kid's not my son. Nigga, she's really using this nigga for a lick, bro. Wait, you look like white beard? Nah, fuck that. I had sex with him once. It's in the paper. Buggy! Oh, Buggy yeah. time! Hey, he came up, nigga. <laughs> yeah, he got his nigga's lip, bro. <laughs> Buggy's business is booming. Booming. Yesterday's price is not today's price, nigga. I feel like I'm like, damn, I didn't get to be Chopper, Brooke, Nami. This nigga's outfit is crazy, yo. Yeah. <laughs> 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 so. <coughs> nah, I think it came to clutch. That shit is long. <laughs> that nigga's already dying, nigga. Dragon looks out of breath. He sounds out of breath. You got asthma, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was gonna fly this whole time. Damn, Robin. I know, right? Sheesh. <laughs> he gave me a nickname. <laughs> to be contundered. 
Yeah, I'm not, I'm not elephants thick. are thick as fuck. Yeah, thick as fuck bro. The, thick, the thickest creatures in the, anim uh, the animal kingdom, alongside of uh, panda. You know, hippopotamus got tanks. Hippos are dangerous. All right, so new arc alert. We got a lot of information. Um, at, uh, Whitebeard yep. has a son out there, Edward Weevil, claiming to be his son. And I think I might have just told you that he was hunting down territory. There is somebody taking down the the rest of the white beard pirates um but it's not edward weevil they're not oh it's not yeah it's not it's not so were they just associating that with him because he was all he's here on the rise new warlord yeah. yeah so he's after them yeah yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. um so they, they there's that there's also um the fact that this that too he yeah. Mm -hmm. so burgess he's been uh after the fight with sabo he hit on his ship and now we're at headquarters for Revolutionary Army. Mm -hmm. We're at where the most wanted man on the planet, Dragon, mm -hmm. is is that with Sabo and the rest of the crew, and now he's calling for reinforcements. He wants the whole Blackbeard Pirates to go there because they have like this um particular mineral or something that's under there, stuff like that. They said that they can mine. Well, they said there's guns and shit over there. He was like, if we come over here, we can get mad uh, ammo and shit. And that yeah, that's, that's what he said. I don't think I don't think Burgess knows about any of that stuff. The ore stuff was brought up um to dragon from koala i believe yeah, yeah. and i think it was from the the weapons that uh they might have got from dress rosa okay yeah that they mm -hmm. brought back from dress rosa so what do we expect from that how, how we expect that to play out right how do we expect uh do you guys believe that edward weevil is white beer's son no and um this how strange is it that this island is an elephant what do you guys think about that if anything well let's talk. first of all that's not white beard son i think that his mom is just doing that using that for clout his mom probably didn't even have any relations with white beard truth be told she's probably just lying because of the mustache and she clearly said well you have the same mustache as him so you must be his son so she doesn't even know she doesn't even so she, the mom might just be delusional. he's got a, a quite a reputation though he got a reputation but now he he and he's be. pretty strong. And even Kizaru was like, yo, um, the only the, the thing is the motherfucker is strong. He was like, yo, you can you. Take, take it for what it is, but the motherfucker is strong. I feel you. He is strong, but that mm -hmm. don't mean that that's his son. Okay. And as far as um as far as the elephant island, honestly, I'm just curious to know how the elephant even got the island on its back and the origin behind that, because I can't really the explanation or and i feel like the elephant actually holds a major significance in the story for how old it is for how it's probably an ancient elephant that's been able to live for that long and hence somebody was rescued by the elephant started a civilization on the body on the elephant's back and hence that's why the there is a city on that elephant because the elephant the elephant's been alive even through the blank period yeah that's yeah. one thing to know because he's a thousand years old yeah you know over a thousand years old in the blank been through it all. yeah exactly <laughs> Um, and you said something else that was... Wait, what was the third thing that you at, at the end, At the end, you said something else. Oh, I just said that. I think that somebody, the elephant rescued, elephant. somebody was saved by the elephant and they started a civilization. And it's funny, I just thought about this because there's a, there's a village people, there's village people on that island that hate humans. They look like the same people that attack Sanji and them. So that hate for humans could probably be because all those thousands of years ago, humans tried to kill this elephant and the person that the elephant saved tried to protect the, tried to protect the elephant from the humans. Hence why the origin of the hate for humans started because there's probably something in that story where they talk about their founder and their founder hates humans because we were trying to rescue this elephant but that's probably not even the case there's probably more to the story that the people actually don't even know but i think that's why they hate the humans white beard out here having kids man <laughs> that's why beard son and that's his wife i could see it in her uh. She's not lying. He looks just like White Bear. He's just as big as White Bear. And I think uh, wait, I can't wait to meet the rest of the White Beards. I think White Bear got better taste. That bitch should look nasty. Unless. Nah, okay. Back in the day, nigga, she had the thing. I'm about to say, like, maybe she aged terribly and shit. She was really looking like Mel. You know what they say, bro? Mel and Moreau and shit like that when she was like in her 20s and shit. But I don't know. I think she's finessing and stuff like that because of the fact that he's strong as fuck and got the resemblance of a father. I think she had like a one night stand with White Bear and she's just using that as like a way, like, all right, but I could just say that, you know, that was his son because fuck, we did, did a little something, yep. something. You feel I me? Mean? So, um, 
Yeah, that's not his son. That was just his, that's his lover. He and honestly, yeah, honestly, I think it was Soba though. He was tripping. Nah, he, he was off the yak. I think she looked. Ah, he was right. I think she looked better back in the day. But yo, yeah, you know what I was thinking? Yo, I think Dragon has his hands on a lot of things, bro. I think it's gonna be one day we get like a ill recap episode, but then it shows um dragon's vantage point how he kind of like helped luffy along the way during certain moments where it's like we really needed him type shit but i only based that off the fact that like this nigga just seems like he's behind like just watching everything and shit so i can't wait to see more dragon yo i think he's gonna i think he already knows burgess is there or has an idea that the nigga's gonna head over there yeah i think uh burgess bit off more you can chew you going to somebody's home court you don't even know what the fuck you getting yourself into. You yeah. just telling people to pull up in here for weapons. You don't know where you at. You don't know what's going to... You're going to get yourself got like that. That's yes. that stupid shit. As they go to a different country, today block. It's like, yo, I'm on the hood. Yo, these niggas got guns. Yo, everybody pull up. I don't know nobody. I don't <laughs> know nothing here. Like, I'm going to get smoked out. Well, Blackbeard has some pretty strong motherfuckers. He bro. does. <laughs> he does, but you also got to think like... When you think about it, like, if Blackbeard, he let out... The people that join his crew and impel down are like Doflamingo caliber. Yeah, elites, nigga. Like Shoot you to rain. Yeah, when Dofl <laughs> Doflamingo goes to um, impel down, he's kept at the bottom floor in the, the sixth level where this nigga pulled those people out of. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah. So think about like the, what his crew really consists of. Yeah, yeah, not nah, for sure. Like, don't get me wrong. I wish the other like the other shit happens. Like, they pull up and violate a lot of revolutionary army type shit. Bro, that would be cold bro, as fuck. Dragon, nigga. You think Dragon's gonna let that shit go down? That's why I don't see it though. I, I have like a, I have like a different level of dra The only thing whack about Dragon is how he really doesn't try to see Luffy at all. But that's what makes me think that he really has his hands full with just making sure that the D serves his destiny. I think that they do. I think that Blackbeard Pirates do put some sort of debt within the revolutionary ar army within this evasion that they do um black keep in mind black beard has multiple devil fruits he doesn't just have one and he has recruited a group of strong motherfuckers and i know dragon may be a savage but considering the people that the, the pieces that black beard has is gonna be they're gonna have a tough time against the black beard pirates especially because they don't see it coming they think that they're in a safe haven they think they're in a, they're in a safe haven they think that they're able to that they have their guard down pretty much at this point. So there's not really much that they're going to be ready for. They took an L. You know what I just remember? <laughs> Singers told all the motherfuckers to pull up. Remember Dragon said, yeah, uh, call all the motherfuckers oh, in the revolutionary and shit damn, 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 to pull up. We got to have... Yo, imagine he did that because this nigga knew that the niggas was there. Bro, he's the ultimate D. Yeah. Come on, yeah. You know yeah. what's gonna yeah. happen? Yeah. To that to that I point. Think he has the ultimate D. I'm no, like, I did not say that. To that to that point, I think Black Bear pulls up and turns around once he sees all those people come to pull, once he sees all the revolutionary army actually pull up to the island. You think somebody like an emperor like Blackbeard is scared of revolution? No, it's not. I don't think he's scared. I think he's just strategic. And I think he picks his battle. I think he chooses his battles wisely, especially at this point, because he's an emperor. It's been two years. His thought process could be completely different than what it was. Um, it's the uh, teach. Marshall D teach. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. So you can't forget about his D too. So it's like D against D. Who's going to win in that soul fight? He's the ultimate D. So it's a sword fight. Huh. You said it's the ultimate sword fight? <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys, well again, more information, more world building, more yeah, more world building, and uh we're on a new island, guys, yeah. which happens to be on a fucking elephant. It's going to be crazy. Oh, from the sky. Island on an elephant Elephant yeah. Island. Yeah. It literally fell from the sky. Onto his you back. think the elephant fell from the sky? No, the city, the, the elephant was already walking, and then like you know how they had that simplest kind of backstory with the sky P, like shit. I got there. blasted up. Yep. Yeah. So I think it's something that the, a sky island fell on this nigga's back and shit like that. And mm -hmm. then on top of that island is another poneglyph. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, <laughs> guys, make sure you like this video. For Pat's theories, Jerry's theories, Evan's theories, Rob's theories, and Wells' theories. <laughs> and Black Thought. I don't know. I just wanted to say Black Thought. 
And if it's first time here, it definitely won't be your last. Make sure you kill, murder, and smash that subscribe button. This is your boy Wells, the Anime King. Pass your guard too. I'm the one. The rest is twos and threes. It's the the myth, the maniac, Wilkins and the squad team. Wow, it's crazy, but you see, it's up And that settles it at the round table. Fuck <laughs> <laughs>